It feels kind of crazy. I can't believe I've done so much in one week. We've all done so much work and learned so many new things. I would say that it's been an emotional roller coaster throughout the week. Um, I've had my ups and I've had, had some uh, downs, but overall I'm feeling very, very positive. So I'm looking forward to um, starting week two. The challenges we've worked through in the week, it's been done together. You know, what, what we've done that day, we haven't written our own things. It's been a totally collaborative process and getting used to doing something like that has been one of my goals. And I do think I have gotten better at working with people um, and explaining things to people as well. The most interesting thing that we learned at Makers Academy in week one was to, using test-driven development, create a simple implementation of the Boris Bike system in place in London. Um, from uh, a client's perspective, they would provide us with user stories. Um, as a developer, um, we would then create domain models and using IRB or Pry, we'd uh, feature test. By following this process, it's a lot clearer to um, implement a, a larger system because you're breaking it down into much smaller pieces. It's really just been implementing everything we've gone over this week, just making sure you can do it by yourself which is very helpful after a week pair programming. I find test-driven development as a concept very understandable, but very difficult to implement. It's a totally new way of thinking. Our coach, Sam, uh, suggested that we go away and um, write down three um, similarities and three differences of uh, each concept and after doing that um, it became much clearer for me um, so I definitely recommend it uh, I recommend this method the simplest steps at a time I, I come from math so I think you know which formula will get do the most things at once is something I really need to get my head around because I feel like I tend to think a bit too far ahead I'm looking forward to pairing with um, some of the other Roniners who I haven't spoken to yet um, our cohort is composed of 24 of us, so I've only managed to pair with um, a handful of them. Um, so yeah, I'm looking forward to working alongside my um, to some fresh faces.